Hello and welcome back to another episode of 20 Below and today we are going to be playing Castle Crashers and I have a, a guest here with me, uh, Naoto. Naoto? Naoto. Ah. Hey, how's it going below? Pretty good. Um, so you've, uh, you've never played this game before, correct? I've never played this game before, no. It's going to be a, a blind uh, run-through. All right, well... Uh, you're familiar with games such as uh, like Golden Axe, Streets of Rage, Hack and Slash kind of deals. Yeah, yeah, I've played those uh, beat 'em ups, you know, from uh, from the '90s, and of course you see them a lot in uh, those uh, Super Nintendo and uh, SNES, uh, you know, mini consoles that you can yeah. attach to your TV, and uh, yeah, it's a fun fun uh, gameplay mechanic. Yeah, well, this is this is pretty much that, but it adds uh, RPG elements uh, for a little twist, and um, I'm gonna read a little synapse right here. It says, uh, "Hack, slash, and smash your way to victory in this award-winning 2D arcade adventure from the Behemoth." So, not really much to go on, but it's a pretty basic game. the The story is fairly straightforward, hey. which we'll get into later. It sounds sweet. RPG and beat 'em up. What what else do you need? Yeah, and it it has uh, nice uh, hand drawn like graphics and a lot of uh, potty humor. <laughs> Ooh, so... potty humor, you say? <laughs> Straight from the toilet. <laughs> yeah. So all right, let's uh, get into it. Uh, as you can see, it brings you up to this book, and you have uh, back off barbarians, arena, and castle crashers. And uh, first, let's talk about these these two on the left back off barbarians and arena okay so all right so uh, back off barbarians uh the the color of your knight is pretty irrelevant right now so whichever one you want to pick i like red personally i'll do green so this is just a a fun little uh i think it's a push egg fun little mini game and it's, it's easier to explain or easier to play than to explain so basically uh the the color of your buttons is the direction that you're going to move in and you want to avoid the barbarians so if you want to go uh down you'll push red or whatever and there's also arrows along with the colors, and the arrows point in the direction that that color button is in. So, they'll kind of trip you up. You just want to know that yellow is on the top, red is uh, right, left is blue, but so that's that. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, enough of that. So then we have Arena. Arena, I don't really need to get into that. It's uh, you go into it and you'll fight NPCs until you die. So let's get into crashing some castles. Alright, so knights. Red knight has electric magic. Blue knight has frost magic. Orange knight has fire magic. That guy has nothing. Green knight has poison magic. Hmm. Let's see here. Frost sounds pretty cool. I'll stick with the original green. Yeah, I used to watch that. I adore that show. So this is how the game starts. We're here partying in the castle and some guy dies. <sighs> Reminds me a lot of the opening to... Or not the opening. Uh, Mighty Python and the Holy Grail. Yeah. I could tell you more about animal orbs. First, okay. So you can uh, retrieve animal companions throughout the game, and they all have Ooh. various effects. And that guy tells you about items. This guy tells you about magic. And that guy tells you about combat. Um, yeah. I don't think I could actually click to talk to anybody. 
Well, all right. So yeah, uh, basic story, we have to uh, retrieve the king's magic diamond thingy and save the princesses. Of course. Save the princess, retrieve the thing, feed them up. Yep, and kill, any kill anyone that looks at you the wrong way. What's the right way of looking at people? I've never understood that, <laughs> like, expression. Uh, I don't know. I guess the friendly? Fr friendly, like, with a smile? Yeah, hi, how are you? Yeah, fair enough. I mean, if someone came up to me and they started growling at me, I'd be pretty upset. Right now we're fighting barbarians. They kind of look like, uh, I don't know, if Jason was a caveman. <laughs> There's the princesses getting carried off. So there are multiple princesses. There are four princesses, one for Ooh. each of us, but because there's two, we each get two. We each get two. Perfect. And uh, much like Mario, the princesses are in various castles. <laughs> various castles, typically the wrong castle. Yeah. Yeah, I have to say the gameplay is pretty smooth. Oh yeah, it's his uh and Oh did I just pop his head off? Wow. Yeah, it's a little bit brutal. But the game Yeah, it's pretty brutal. They make they make quite a few good games. This is the only one I've actually played by them, but I I know of others that are very similar. Yeah. So twenty, ex explain to me what is the rating on this on this game. So I'm seeing a lot of blood, I'm seeing a lot of uh Head chopping off. You know, uh, I, I didn't look that much into it, but if I had to guess, I would say probably a uh, T. Here's a shop. We could buy a sword or a potion. Again, I don't. Oh, that's high. Is that how I buy stuff? No, I got what you need. No shirt, no shoes, no service. You have to how push, do I? You have to push X, which is your like uh, attack button. How do I equip stuff? Well, we can't do that here. Um, if you find a weapon on the ground, I believe it is X to change. But there is a place where we will go where you can change hmm. your weapon. Interesting. I don't have enough monies, so, so it doesn't matter. This is the world map. We just did Castle Keep. So we're going to go back here to uh, the blacksmith. Yeah. Have you ever seen JoJo's Bizarre Adventure? Uh, can't say that I have. So, ever since I watched that show, it's it, it's a pretty good show, I have to admit. Yeah. Uh, I every time I hear the world, I I can't stop thinking of memes of that show. Hmm. It's it's fantastic. So here this we are. This is a stable. This is the Ark. This is where all our animal companions will be held. And we can swap them out at any time. And once we find them all, we unlock whatever's behind this door. And I imagine it's a cat, because that's what's on the ceiling. Never actually unlocked Oh, it. kitty. So yeah, this is the, the animal Ark. Noah's Ark, if you will. Can we run? Uh, I think this is as fast as we go. Hmm. Oh, and you get to throw right your animals. And if we go inside this uh, <laughs> this frog, this is where our weapons are stored. Of course, because you you want to put your weapons in a frog. And we have uh, like the bunny is agility, the skull is critical, the poofy thing is magic, the muscles is strength, and this this frog goes on uh, pretty far. So. Whew. We can get, we can find quite a bit of weapons. He's much, wow. He's much bigger on the inside. <laughs> <laughs> I can see that. And what is this, Time Lord technology? There's his butt. That, huh. Can we exit that way? Uh, I don't think so. You'd think if, you'd be able to. I don't know if we'd want to. Well, I mean, it'd be a lot quicker than having to run all the way back. <laughs> this is true.
So I'm seeing a big nada right next to my name under the one. Do you yes. see that? That means you have no items. Oof. And you could switch that uh, once you get items. I think you push the, the L, B, and R, B bumpers, the top ones, and that will change your items from nada to something. Hmm. So here on the left, this is an arena. There are multiple uh, in the map, and if we complete the arena, we unlock a new playable character. Very cool. Is that something you're interested in trying, or you just want to move forward? I kind of want to see a little bit more of the gameplay, you know, a little bit more of what the game has to offer. All right, let's go to the Barbarian's War. Well, that's quick. Oh, and if you noticed earlier, we've uh, we picked up a compass when we were at the blacksmith. That'll be important later. Of course it will be. There are many Zelda-like uh, items in this game. So, like, key items that you yeah. need in order to advance? Yeah, you can, you can get a bow, a boomerang, uh, other things. And I keep looking at your character thinking it's me. <laughs> <laughs> So what is, uh, do you, do you see that on your screen? I'm emitting some sort of... Yes, that is your magic. You push that and then you uh, push your Y button or whatever button it is to use your spells. Oh, that's pretty cool. And as you level up... Oh, I learned a new combo. As you level up, you can uh, unlock more spells. I like this. I wish there was some sort of HUD menu where I could, like, press R3 or L3 and I'd be able to see all the different spells and whatnot. Um, I think there is something similar, but I believe we have to be in the world map to do that. Yeah. When I see your name, I, I want to call you NATO. NATO. <laughs> <laughs> well, if I can help the world push back the threat of communism, then <laughs> I am. Well, we, I'm happy to. I picked up Ooh. the bow. Now I can use B to, to shoot some arrows. Guys, giving the other guy CPR. Just, just, like, giving the CPR. <laughs> Jesus. And you see in the background, there is there's quite the battle going on. Oh yeah. So there's droves of enemies piling into each other. But really, I mean, there's not a whole lot to be said about this game. Like, what we're doing right now is is 90% of the game. Just running around and beating stuff up. Yeah, at least in these uh, these beginning parts, there's really not too much to say. Yeah. I mean, maybe it'll get harder. I mean, I've lost a lot of health. So yeah. here's, here's our mini boss. You want to stay out of the red circles and not get run over. Yeah. And he opens up and more barbarians will fly out. Ooh, that hurts. That's okay. Should've bought a potion earlier. Uh, if you die, I can revive you. So are the bananas and the cherries like health or something? Yeah, it's, it's, it's like, uh, like Pac-Man. You pick up the fruit and it gives you health. Well, that's not really the case in Pac-Man. Pac <laughs> it's a little different. Oof, that hurts. Huh. Oh, he's down. He's right. done. Right. Moving forward. That 
it's funny because like we're we're wearing helmets and such, but you can see our like eyeballs bulging out when we get attacked. Yeah. Oh, I did not. Did I want to pick that up? I don't think I want to pick that up. Which one do I want? Yeah, I'll stick with the base. Yeah, and every, and every weapon that you find will then be available in the frog. Oh, okay. And every animal that you find will be available in the arc. I'm sensing a lot of uh, biblical s uh, scenes going on here. Arcs and... Oh, yeah. Well, I don't usually... I mean, there were frogs in the Bible, but... I kind of thought of Jonah with there being a giant frog. With the giant frog, yeah. Maybe, maybe giant like... fish. Yeah. Kill them in their sleep now. Ooh, and locks up. Still this. I don't want that. I like the mace. <laughs> it, it really wants you to use that weapon. And, and the graphics are definitely uh, unique. Oh yeah, well, what would you what would you call this? Like, as far as graphics, uh, hand drawn. I don't know. Like almost comic book like. Yeah. This is a Newgrounds game, right? Definitely yes. is reminiscent they, of the the Flash era. Yeah, they uh, they are. Uh, a partner of new grounds. I found a pair. Uh oh, boss time. All right. There's the princesses. The one princess's name is. Or that name face is covered up. Huh. And now we gotta fight this knuckle dragger. Uh, he's not as tough as he looks, except I just got pummeled. Uh, yeah, watch out for that door. <laughs> but he has he has very uh, long range horizontal attacks, so you want to stay uh, in the front or behind him. And. From time to time, the, the audience of the barbarians will jump up to obscure your view. Like that. Oh, yeah. I'm getting hurt. Ah, whew. You almost had me. Gotta be quicker than that. Oh, they're taking them away. Watch out for that beard guzzling. I see what you mean about the potty healer. <laughs> oh, I'm dead. Oh. I will I will try to save you. Uh... Wait, are you alive? Ooh. Oh, yes. Nice. <laughs> So I'm assuming I can do that to you, too. Yes. If we both die, then the game is over. <laughs> yeah. So is, is the health... Oh, there it goes again. Is the health dependent of, of the enemies on how many players there are? Uh... Well, the only ever time I played this game was by myself, so... I... can't say that I am too sure, but I would imagine yeah. so. Yeah. I'll wait till he's done with that. Need him. Oh, there I am. Oh no, don't die. Gotta pick up that pair. There you go. You got this. I believe in you, 20. I'm just gonna try and... Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> well, anyway, now we can level up. If we get the, uh, the sparkly blue line, you get a new, uh, spell. Definitely want to do spell. All right, then we could just go right to here and not right to there, right to here. Just 
go right back to the boss again. Perfect. I think I played a demo for this game one time on uh, Xbox 360, and the, the demo ended at this boss fight, and that, that little guy came out, and I was like, oh, he's not too bad. <laughs> and then the big guy busts down the door, and I was like, oh, shit. Oh, oh no. <laughs> oh, no. Yo, mess him up. He is quite intimidating. Oh, it's not that bad. Ain't nothing but a thing. <laughs> okay, he's got the, the five o'clock shadow going on. <laughs> you mean the I've never shaven look? <laughs> Oh, I got sprint. Extra Y. Huh. Well, imagine that. And they throw these other guys at you, just not just to be annoying, but they can also drop health. Yeah. But it's also annoying. Super annoying. Oh, we've got this. All right. Got him. Now time to get the loot. Nice. It's a rich money. Hope you brought your scissors. Very cool. I think Ow. we'll fight each other. Oh, what? I think we're fighting over the princess now. How dare you! Good <laughs> sir. Lay down your arms. We're just standing around like a bunch of jerks. <laughs> now what do we do? <laughs> You have defeated me in battle. Aha. Uh -huh. Now I get to make out with her. <laughs> <laughs> Fantastic. And that's that. Hey, we got a character. Yeah. Awesome. Level one? Is that level one? Yeah, it's level one. Level one down. So we'll, uh, we'll, we'll take a break. And then we'll start level two, if you have the time. Sure. I think, uh, I think that's doable. 